my dear delegates, this is Michael J. Orden, and we have the latest news from the situation in Iraq. Last night, the situation went completely insane. Both President Bush and Saddam Hussein went live on television declaring war to each other. The United States mobilized their troop through Kuwait and launched some amazing airstrikes to the city of Basra. The problem was that the Iraq army bought some illegal weapons from I don't know which country, probably China, Russia, or the black market, and repealed American airstrike. So, the U.S. cabinet decided to launch some freedom through the land forces, and this is where everything starts to get blurry. Some intel around Iraq said that there were already Iranian troops in Basra, but our brave troops launched a direct attack against the Iranian troops as well. The mad dog Saddam Hussein decided to launch kamikaze strikes against U.S. Army and possibly the Iranian Army. I mean, we don't really know if these tyrants are working together and they just play this to cheat the international community that they are enemies. They don't care about human lives, so anything is possible, right? In the end, Iranian, American, and Iraqi lives were lost, and there is no real information of what happened at the end. I'm really confident the U.S. Army went victorious in this brave assault against tyranny, and we could store democracy in the region. Thanks again for joining us on Mox News. I'm Michael J. Orden. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. I'm Michael J. Orden. You might remember me from the news, the merch table, or even the elevator. When I'm not working, I do like to work out. Chill by the pool. Admire my work. Sometimes, I even like to spy on you while you're trying to figure out who's gonna save the world tonight. But most of all, I like to drink out of my Mimin 6 thermos. Even you, yes you, can get one for only 200 pesos. Now get out of here. Pick yours up at the merch table. Good morning, delegates. I'm Rihanna Little, and you are watching Telemundo with the most pressing news of the day. Escalations reach a critical point as U.S. President George Bush and Iraqi Prime Minister Saddam Hussein declare war against each other in front of national news outlets. According to military officials, the invasion was originated in Kuwait with the target of disarming military bases close to the southern city of Basra. Initial air operations proved unsuccessful as recently acquired Iraqi technology managed to shoot down two airstrike bombing sequences. Correspondents reported changes to the invasion strategy into ground troops assault. Light gunfire erupted outside of Basra when Saddam Hussein used kamikaze tactics to both the invading armies. And all parties involved are assessing their position, ultimate goal and means of achievement. Thanks for watching. My name is Ariana Little. Thank you next.